away from that. Mother of former President Omar Yaradua has been buried in Katina State. The funeral prayer was performed at the Katina Township Stadium with Vice President Kashim Shatima and other dignitaries in attendance. Abdul Latif Yusuf reports and will return with business news. Hundreds of family members, well wishes, and the Vice President Kashim Shatima attended the funeral prayers of the mother of the late President Umaru Musayaradua in Kazana. The prayers, led by Imam Aminu Yamawa on the reins, was also attended by the former Vice President Atiku Abubakar, the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Mr. Peter Obi, the governors, members of the OPA Legislative Chamber, and the Speaker of the House of Representatives. Ship, ship, ship. Also in attendance were the former PDP chairman Adamuma Azu, Yayele Ahmed, among others. She is a byword for resilience, for wisdom, and strength of character. She bore a pipe of her kids. Why? And I felt that did not deter her from opening her doors to welcome all and sundry with the comfort of her home. May Allah grant her soul eternal rest. Hajia Dada is known for her philanthropic activities, especially feeding the poor and the vulnerable and building of Islamic schools to educate children. In her 103 years, Hajia Dada has impacted humanity greatly and had also witnessed sorrowful moments to see two of her children dying at the pinnacle of their career. Hajia Dada was also loved and respected by key political figures from all over the country. I think, uh, she has lived a very good life, not only for herself, but for all of us. She taught us morals, and she has led us very well. She was a woman who does not speak much, but she speaks with wisdom. It's a great loss to the nation, considering the mother, it was the mother of the president, and some of us have come to visit her. Everything told about her was a great life. May Allah forgive her sins and grant her eternal rest. Thank Dignitaries have continued to troop in from all over the country to grieve and identify with the family at this sorrowful moment. Abdul Latif Yusuf, TVC News, Katana.